Hi Libra, welcome to your weekly forecast. Now this is for March 31st until October 6th. Let's take a look what's going to be coming your way. Libra, you're already having a hard time dealing with your domestic stuff and your domestic problems. It seems like there's also a part of you who wants to move and go away. Well, like pack your things and, you know, walk away from that environment. Yet somehow there is someone who is acting like a very cold, cruel, mean, cold and distant uh, woman around you. And I feel like you will sit down and talk to this, you know, to this person. I feel like this is your spouse that you are, you know, that you are currently dealing with. Yet somehow you will also find out the truth about why this person feels this way. And there will be some harmony that will be restored. Okay. Changes are also coming your way, which is, you know, it's all positive. And your emotions will be outpouring, you know, both the... Um, you know, in front of you, and I feel like you will also be tra you will also be planning to travel, or you are. It's like there is a particular country that you are thinking, or you know, to visit and go back home. And uh, try to mend things, or try to you know restore things to how they used to be. You know to yourself that there are a lot of you know that there are a lot of you know things that you cannot provide or you did not provide it in the past and um your you know your spouse is feeling a little bit voided okay or they're feeling a little bit insensitive right now or they feel like blank okay now there will be s there is somebody from the past which is I feel like this is a, a fire with an earth, double earth and fire person who used to make you happy and who used to give you a lot of, you know, um, elating feeling and you, f and you feel more loved and cared and you're the, you're the one who actually pushed this, p this person away. And now you can't really do anything because you're, you know, you're already tied, you're already married, you already have your own family. But and even if you want to go back to this person, or even if you will try to reminisce those good old times with this person, you're already in a committed relationship. Now, be very careful to give in to the temptation because I feel like there's a part of you who feels weak already and who feels a little bit, um, you know, out of your wits because you don't know how to fix your your marriage woes and you don't know how to fix your own, you know, marital problems and you've been you you have tried to adjust your life, even your job, even your obligations, even your finances. You're the one who's been taking care of everything just to give way to, you know, to your spouse because you know, you know, you know, in the past that there has been a lot of imbalances, and uh, you've heard of this person, but uh, you know, I mean, you cannot just pay for this whole thing all your life. There needs to be some sort of a balance, and I feel like you will be communicating back with this person from the past. And you will be a little bit happy. It will start from a very casual conversation at first because you're getting bored with your life. You're just staying at home or you're just, you know, uh, sitting down there all day. And uh, some Libras are always just taking care of your kids, you know. And I feel like you will also start thinking of traveling just to get away from the uh, from this toxic environment for a little while. And I feel like this is where you will try and find a new beginning on your own. Or a new beginning of your own. And you will somehow feel that, you, that there is a mission, you know, right in front of you that you should fulfill, that you need to, you know, you need to do. 
um, I also feel like there is a business idea or there is like a work that you will be thinking about changing or putting up and with this you'll be asking for the advice and inputs of you know your other your other relatives but you're not going to get their support okay especially if you'll be asking the relatives of your spouse they're not going to be supporting you with anything and even if you will try to ask for the support of your spouse still you know she's not going to believe you or he's not going to believe you anymore so you need to be a little bit more um independent if you're so afraid of making that mistake you know actually you know in business you will be successful if you already made a lot of mistakes and what's important is that in every every time you stumble and every time that you you know <laughs> fall flat on the ground you will still stand up you know with pride and you will keep on learning until that you've already mastered it and until that you're already better with that that right at this point you know it's actually good because you already have your own resource and it's good because you already have your own you know your own um pillar or your own your own foundation means that there is something that you can start from and like the others that they need to, to really start from the scratch but this you only need to stand on your own believe in yourself and have faith in yourself most of the people around you will never believe that you will be successful or that this will you know rise up or that this will work out because of your crazy ideas but you know what just go ahead with it and keep on believing in yourself have more faith the more people put you down you should have more faith in yourself okay and don't let other people tell you what you should be doing or tell you where you should be good at or tell you what you should be not good at okay and as far as your marital problems um it's gonna take some time before you will be mending your differences and since that your partner is not willing to let their guard down or to you know for them to compromise or to at least fix the situation it's not only you or it can't only be you who wants to <clears throat> who wants to fix this relationship it should be the two of you because if it's only the two because if it's only you who wants to save the relationship and save the marriage and your partner is obviously moving away pulling away and cutting you off being so mean not really doing their obligations and not doing you know the things that they are supposed to be doing to you when you're married then you know it's time for you to take a few steps back and it's time for you for you to think about yourself for a little while and let them figure out what do they really want and if they notice that you're starting to move away and they still play dead or they still play cold towards you then it's time for you to retreat you cannot force somebody to feel the same way that you do and yes we do all make we all do make mistakes and we all create you know a lot of stupid stuff in the past out of our immaturities but it can't always be like that you know people can change and so are you so keep on believing in yourself and have a stronger faith you will eventually get there and about the problems that you have in your life right now i feel like around you is also trying to put a curse on you or trying to do some you know some some stuff okay for you to go through with this out of spite and out of uh, jealousy and i feel like you need to you will be nailing down who that person is because it's just very very close to you and you already know who that person is all right and i feel like uh, physically this person is already around you okay now anyway that's it for you for this week libra if you want to talk to me live on the phone or live the calls just go and visit me at my website at sophieangel.net blessings to you